guys, so today I have a very long awaited video and I'm so sorry for not posting in for a, a while, let's just say that. <laughs> and I feel terrible about it. The reason why I couldn't post is because uh, my mom got a new phone and it won't let me film on there and I couldn't figure it out. It was so annoying. So finally, I went to the iPad and I'm like, well, can I use this? And so far, it's been working. Alrighty. This video today is going to be a custom tour. Um, my custom Schleich horses, basically. I was going to do a spring barn tour. That was requested by... Oh, can I remember the name? Schleich and Star Stable Lover. I think it was. Anyway, she requested that. And I am going to be doing a spring barn tour before summer, which is in a few days. <laughs> and I have remodeled completely, so everything is a little different now. I'm sorry if you can hear my birds. But anyway, so let's get on with the video. I'll start with my oldest to my newest horses. Okay. So... My oldest custom that I've done, this is Replica, you all know her, you've seen her in, I think, a few barn tours and, um, I did a video about her. Anyway, so yeah, this is Replica, and I really like her, I may repaint her, at the time she looked really good to me, but then I've gotten better, so, she still looks good, I may not repaint her, we'll see, I might just leave her. Uh, it really depends, <laughs> but I, I do love her still. Anyway, so that's Replica, and she's super pretty. And then, my next custom, I don't know which one came first. I'm pretty sure it was this one. Okay, this is Partner, and he's my Appaloosa Stallion. He was originally a paint, but now he's an Appaloosa. And... I really do like him. I may redo his blanket a little bit just because it's not the most realistic. I mean, it doesn't look horrible, but it doesn't look amazing either. So I may redo that. Anyway, so yeah, that's him. And he's really cute. And then our third horse is, wait, no, not him. <laughs> this is Star. This was my little filly that I, okay, there's, oh, no, <laughs> that's not good. Well, anyway, there was a little filly that I had trained, and I'm still training her to this day, and her name is Star, and the owner of her might be getting rid of her, so I did a custom on her because I didn't want to forget her, and she's just so cute. This is kind of what she looks like. I redid her tail so it's white. But anyway, you get the general idea. So, yeah, that's Star. She's super cute. Uh, one of my favorite little foals ever. Sweetest little thing. Anyway, so that's her. And then next, this is a more recent one. So, the farther up we go, the better they get. <laughs> anyway, so this is Coconut. And he used to be the oh, retired Andalusian. And Illusion Stallion, sorry. But now he is a old flea bitten gray. And I recently just found this out that as a gray gets older, they turn into a flea bite, flea bitten gray. So that's, I, I've always loved this coloring and I did not know that. But now I do. <laughs> and he is one of my favorites because I. I did a lot of detail on him. His, I, you can't really tell, but his eyes do have brown in them. And he has a little speck. It's super cute. And I really do like him. He's pretty. So that's Coconut. Next we have Lightning. This is the twin brother of Partner. Partner and Lightning originally were the paint stallions. So... I customized them. I don't know why I customized both, but I am kind of sad that I did. Anyway, that's beside the point. <laughs> so yeah, this is Lightning, and he is one of my favorite customs that I've ever done, because 
this was kind of a happy accident, but I did a super good job on his shading on his legs. I mean, that's partly just because he's a really dark horse and it blends really nicely. And he is one of my favorites because he just, he turned out so good. I kind of want to redo the markings on him. I was going for Indian look, which it did turn out okay, but they're, this one's a little unrealistic. This one looks okay, but anyway. Okay, the next one, I love him. Once I figure out how to put a logo for my little circle thing where you find the, the name, because mine is an orange S, which I want to upgrade it to something else. Anyway, this guy is going to be my front picture. This is Hidalgo. And I repositioned him. Or, yeah, I repositioned him. So, he has his ears pinned. And he originally was the Mustang Stallion. And he's still a Mustang. I kept that breed. And if any of you have seen the movie Hidalgo, you would know who he is. And I am so happy with him. Uh, I really love him. I gave him a bigger forelock. Because I just want to, wanted it to be a little more dramatic. And then his ears were hard to do, but eventually I did get it. And they're actually detailed inside. They have a little bit of shape to them. So that was really nice. Anyway, so that's a Dalgo. The next horse I have, this is my... Uh, <laughs> he's my boy. Let's just say that. <laughs> so this here is Patriot. And yes, I did make him his own custom blanket and halter and lead. Yeah, I spoiled him. <laughs> and he really is gorgeous let me take off this tack real fast so that you can take a better look at this boy so uh, patriot here took me mm, i want to say two days to paint i think yeah actually i'm lying it took longer <laughs> i had to reposition him because Reason why I bought him is because his tail was actually broken off. And so at DMB, that's where I got him. They put a 50% off discount, and I'm so happy that they did. Anyway, so I repositioned his tail, and it looks really good. You can't even hardly tell. So this is Patriot, and honestly, he is one of my favorite customs. Besides Hidalgo and coconut and lightning <laughs> but he is just a stunner honestly uh yeah i really really like him so this is his new tail and it does have a few things i would change but oh well this is that side of him he was originally the new 2020 black forest horse who's the stallion and my sister has the original one, which I'm glad I have a custom of him because I have something unique that not many people have, <laughs> or no one has. And Schleich has actually changed their logo, which kind of bothers me. Just zoom in. So that's a newer logo, and then let me show you. Can I see it on him? Kind of. Okay. Let me show you the logo on Hidalgo. Uh, well, you can tell that they're different. They're definitely different. Which, honestly, that kind of bothers me. That they change their logo. How dare they? <laughs> anyway, that's beside the point. So that is my full collection tour. And I am very proud of it. I love them all. Like I said, I may customize a few, definitely not Hidalgo, Coconut, Patriot, or Lightning are getting customized, no way. <laughs> I may consider customizing Partner and Replica, we'll see. 